So what is going on guys? Welcome to another Garden Warfare 2 video. Today is unlucky episode number 13 of a Spending Spree Saturdays. Every Saturday you are going to see a pack opening on my channel. Now we have Lewis here, one of my moderators and good friends as, uh, as good luck. He's rocking the brain slug as well. But today we have 1,038,000 coins to spend. We're not going to be using this, uh, this, this machine, this pack machine. We're actually going to be going over to one down this portal because it is episode number 13. Maybe today it's going to be lucky number 13 and uh, we can pack ourselves a few legendaries because so far to this date this is episode number 13 we've spent about 12 to 13 million coins and we've only had one legendary sticker this entire time and that was a piece to the toxic brains now today we're going to be opening only wondrous packs of greatness we did uh, a few videos ago we did only amazing brains packs last week was the fertilizer fun pack so today we're only going to be opening the wondrous packs of greatness so let us start off and and hopefully we can get a few legendaries in today's pack opening. So let us see what we start with. We get a few Hypno Shrooms, which is pretty awesome. We get the Gem Exhaust or Goggles. I like this one, the gold money beard is, is pretty awesome. We have a nice couple of uh, silver tattoos there as well and also a weed. Now, a lot of you guys seem to enjoy going through the uh, going through the packs just that little bit quicker. And this is a very slow pack. Oh, that slowed down so much. I thought we may have got a legendary in that pack opening. I see this quite a lot. I do see the puppy dictatorship quite a lot. We got a couple of Mr. Freezies as well. If you love pizza, you're going to love that customization. And that is a nice tattoo as well. So third pack, here we go. Under a million coins now. Come on, we can do it. We can get a legendary in this pack. And we could actually get some, some more customizations to... Not customizations, some more characters to the... Yeah. We could get some more character pieces to uh, Toxic Brains because we are getting the plants and the zombies. We get a future throw as well. That's pretty, pretty awesome. We've got to put that on an uh, imp character, but hopefully we can get another piece to the Toxic Brain. So we actually have a new legendary character and we also maybe could get something to the computer scientist as well. We get gold eight balls right there. No, can't really see too much gold in that actual customization itself, but uh, nevertheless, that is another gold customization. So we get something cool for the pea shooter there. We get a couple of Halley the Healers as well. Silver Sleepy Bunny for the Rose character. Diamond Cotton Candy Delight. I don't know if I've got the standard cotton candy, but that one is pretty, pretty awesome. We have the gem pea punk, which I do love that customization. And we also get a few terracotta weeds as well. But hopefully we can get a legendary in this pack opening. Can it be lucky number 13? I guess we're going to have to wait and find out. We get some more money beards there. This one is the gem money beard. We get a couple of toxic gloom shrooms. We get bubbly waves, which is a nice tattoo for the chomper class. I really do enjoy the, the, uh, the tattoos for the chomper classes. The only downside to them, is when there's an Ermid Chomper has got a tattoo and you can't even tell that it is an Ermid Chomper. So uh, yeah, oh, we get Diamond Terrible Tentacles. I did see a pea shooter wearing those early earlier and I thought that was very creepy as a pea shooter wearing them. But uh, nevertheless, we get those in Diamonds. We also get a Gold Fun Planet of Saturn on the Super Brains forehead as well. So here we go. The next, um, what are they called? Wondrous Pack of Greatness down. Here we go. We get Telementary Visor. We get some Goop Shrooms. We also get Diamond Modernized Mask of the Old. We get some Brown Coat, uh, some Buckethead Zombies. <laughs> we get some Gold Emergency Rolls and some things for the zombies as well. But I just, I really do want to get a piece to Toxic Brain. So we actually have another legendary character and the first legendary character for the game as well. We get a couple of Uplink Bots. We get some Diamond Drake Flappers for the Pea Shooter, Silver Stripey Surprise for the Imp, and some Gold Eye Patch Patterns for the Captain Deadbeard as well. So here we go, we're under 700,000 coins now, hopefully we can get something, I know I do keep saying that, but I really do want to get something. We get a special, I get quite a lot of specials, I just don't get too many legendaries. This is Gold Cheese Tricks, I actually love that customization for the uh, for the Pea Shooter, you can actually get that for doing a, a, a quest in the Backyard Battleground, and and I love it because the cheese actually wobbles. When the pea shooter moves side to side, the cheese actually wobbles. And I really do enjoy that. And come on, really? You give us two different customizations, uh, consumables. We get five Oto zombies and a karate zombie. We get some more pizza if you like it in diamond. Well, there you go. And uh, yeah, I just feel like that... Um we're just so unlucky with these packs. You know, we, we open a lot of packs and... 
We just, we, well, there we go. We get gem pizza beard as well. We're getting all of the pizzas in this pack opening. I love that one. That one kind of reminds me of like a, a melted ice cream for some reason. If you're getting like strawberry ice cream, it's, it's, it kind of reminds me of like it's melted. But well, that is the gold low fat. Oh, oh wait, it's ice cream. Oh. Well, uh, well, that would be why. I was kind of looking at the image, not the text itself. Oops, I actually thought it was gold fat yogurt. Oh, yogurt for you Americans over there. We get another one of those as well. What's this? When we get diamond low fat ice cream, gold loose wires, a nice silver pretty bowl for the sunflower, and also a weed. Don't really use too many spawnables in this game, to be honest. I'm going to hold my hands up and say I use the potted plants. I use the bo uh, the builder bots, but I don't really use the spawnable zombies too much in, in this game. But there we go. We got a fried egg for the cactus. That one looks hilarious. I, I should really put that on my characters. Like, I, I, I don't customize them enough, and I should. The reason why is when I do a character showcase or something using the characters like a top five, which will be coming back tomorrow. I do want to apologize for not having one it last week. Um, I've been traveling and stuff. I, I tend to put my characters as just not being customized, and then I keep forgetting to... Uh, to change them but here we go under 500,000 coins now we are halfway through this unlucky pack number 13 or maybe it can be the lucky one you never know we could get a few legendaries in a row we get gem hat of pain for the citron there we could get a few legendaries in a row i hope that we can i would love to get a piece to the computer scientist as well as that other piece for the toxic brains i don't want any karate zombies like i said i don't really use too many of them to spawn them up that one is creepy I'm actually curious if that actually covers the engineer or it goes on top of the engineer. I think it covers the engineer. Um, I don't think I've seen that customization. If I got it, I have not noticed myself. So, um, I don't know. Here we go. Gold Future Shooter. Not seen that before. We get some Doom Shrooms. I think we've actually seen quite a lot of Doom Shrooms in this game. Uh, in this pack opening so far, we also get Diamond Rind Pro. I actually like the original one for that one. I think it's like a, a turquoise bluey green color and it looks pretty nice actually kind of the same color to the bottom of the wondrous pack of greatness i just really want some legendaries gem at yarn bun we get gem at number one p fan we're getting a lot of gem stuff in this pack opening as well but come on come on we've got 338,000 coins we've got to start getting some legendaries here 13 million coins spent this is probably going to be 14 million after today's video well it's going to be at least 14 million because in one pack opening we actually did 2 million coins so uh, it's going to be at least 14 million probably going on to 15 million coins uh, i would say due to um packs that have opened not on the game like packs that have opened in stream so probably going on to 15 million coins now and we've only had one legendary sticker so one of these days i'm gonna get like a pack opening with like 200 <gasps> i've wanted that for so long <laughs> Um, I, as I was just saying then, I, uh, there's going to be one pack opening where I'm going to get so many legendaries, but this Knitted Nightmare, I've seen that in Flag of Power so, so much, and I've wanted it for so long because it looks awesome, and it actually makes the pea shooter look like a brand new variant, so I'm happy that I've got that. I'm definitely going to be putting that on my pea shooter characters, but yeah, hopefully we can, um, we can get some legendaries in this pack opening. All right, come on, under 200,000 coins now. Let's do this. Dandelion weeds, they're not what we want. We want some legendaries. We're getting a lot of gem stuff for the modernized mask of the, I don't know, what whatever the last name is for it. Come on. Come on. Here we go. I think we could open like another, what is it, 35,017, maybe another four packs after this one. And we've still not got a legendary. We're getting some hypno shrooms again. Diamond super seashell. We get diamond aviators. We get spooky smile tattoo for the imp. I love the tattoos in this game. The tattoos can make these characters look so funny in the game. There's a couple of them that are hilarious. And uh, there's one for the actual... Uh, oh. Power vision. <laughs> if you want to plug, there you go. Uh, there is actually a tattoo for the um, for the Captain Deadbeard, and I think it's called like Plank, and it just makes his face look like it's made out of wood. And I absolutely love that tattoo. The only downside is if you put any customizations on his face, Honeybeard. Ooh, if you put any customizations on his face, it makes them look. Uh, it's hard to actually see the tattoo anyway. Uh, because the customizations can take up a lot of the space, especially if you do use some kind of a mustache for Captain Deadbeard. So that's the downside. There we go. We get another special. We get Diamond Cheese Tricks. We get Silver Power Vision, which is very similar to the one we got earlier. But in Silver, we get five Snapdragons, some Stealth Revives, Cash Bag. That's one I've never seen before. We get Silver Assault Can, Gem Stuck Salad. And uh, this is going to be the last Wondrous Pack of Greatness. We are going to be able to open an extraordinary pack as well 
but no legendary in this final wondrous pack of greatness. We get some snapdragons, we get the golden all-star statue. I think I've got nearly every single one of the statues that are golden now in the backyard battleground. We get gem thought processes for the super brains, gold ski mask, and also some terracotta weeds. Now let us go down to an extraordinary pack, and then we will be able to open a helpful fun pack as well. To finish off this pack opening, we get gold birthday head. I love these customizations for the chomper. Gold Condiment Vision, Diamond Satellite Spyware, Flag Zombie Times 3, Gold Soggy Cereal, a Rocket Bot, and uh, here we go with a helpful fun pack. And the final pack in today's pack opening, what are we going to get? We get five newspaper zombies, Dusty Oranges Tattoo, we get a Mr. Electro, Gold Wood Frames, and also a Gem Stacked Deck. But there we go, guys. Those is episode 13 of the Spending Spree Saturday. Unlucky number 13. Lewis, you did not give us any good luck. But uh, yeah, there we go, guys. Hopefully you did enjoy today's video. Next week, we're going to open another million coins worth, and maybe it could be to do with the new DLC. Maybe it could be a zany Zombopolis pack opening. Who knows? We're going to have to wait and see. But let us actually go over to the sticker book and see how many coins we've actually spent. So we spent 14,262,000 coins. And like I do say, that isn't including coins from chests. But uh, one of these days, we are going to get some legendaries. But there we go, guys. Thank you very much for watching this video. My name is Zerix Fusions. And hopefully, I'll catch you in the next video.